Testimony finished today in the criminal trial over the death of baseball pitcher Tyler Skaggs. It included another player opening up about the use of prescription pills inside the sport. Our Jason Allen takes you inside the federal courtroom today in Fort Worth. Major League pitcher Blake Parker looked like he was fighting back tears when he took the witness stand in federal court today. He testified he had tried an opioid pill once and he didn't like the way that it made him feel numb. So he gave the rest of the pills back to the person he got them from, who he said was Eric Kay, the man who was accused of giving Tyler Skaggs the pill that led to his death. It was Kay's defense team who called Parker as a final witness today. They were trying to get him to talk about flying out for away games and how it might be possible for a player to meet someone at the airport to get something they wanted, like pills. Skaggs died the night after the Angels flew here to Texas in June of 2019, ahead of a scheduled series with the Rangers. Parker didn't give the defense much for that theory, though, that the pills came from someone else. In fact, when news of Skaggs' death got out, he said he was scared because he thought back to the pills that he got from Kay and thought that could have been him. Parker said pill use is not something that is widely talked about among players. They try to keep it in an inner circle. This trial has brought it out, though, in the same week that Governor Abbott was here in town talking about how widespread the counterfeit pill problem has become. Closing arguments in this trial are scheduled to happen here tomorrow morning. In Fort Worth, Jason Allen, CBS 11 News.